Hey guys, WF our Nature and Environment in Japan playlist. Every summer, the old farmhouse comes alive with all manner of critter, big and small. In this case, spiders. Fairly colourful green fellow here. We don't see a lot of these, don't see a lot of these green ones. But we do see a fair variety of spiders. Most of them are pretty small. Almost all of them are harmless. Ironically, the only ones we see in central Japan that are really dangerous are the Australian ones, the redback spiders that have come into Japan through Nagoya Port. We actually showed you that story on a previous video. These ones are little hoppy ones. They sort of hop around really quickly, boing, boing, and they feel threatened. They hop, jump really quickly to wherever they want to go. So we usually just leave them alone because they eat other insects we don't like, like mosquitoes and things like that. So usually these guys, we leave them alone. Occasionally, if we get one that we don't like where he is or something, we might take them outside, let them go outside, but we don't hurt them. They don't do us any harm. We see those as the good guys, the same as the praying mantis and the dragonflies and the frogs and all the other critters that we get in our garden. We don't get a lot of insects in the house. We've mentioned this previously. The house is pretty good for keeping insects out, but these little guys, of course, they're really small. They can sort of sneak in the little corners, and that one's just inside the genkan. He's coming through the front door. Obviously, one of the kids' seats. This has got... We call this a daddy long legs, don't know what it really is, but again, not dangerous. Harmless. We remove the ones that make webs, though. We don't like spider webs through the house, that's not real good. That's an Adams family style of thing, isn't it? <laughs> so, usually, the ones that, that make webs, usually we take them outside, let them go outside. But these little jumpy round ones don't seem to make webs, they sort of hide round corners and under toilet seats <laughs> not really under toilet seats but they hide hide behind the toilet system on places like that that don't seem to make webs so we just leave those guys alone they don't do us any harm they'll they'll eat whatever insects are around <laughs> anyway no doubt that creeped a couple of people out more videos coming soon